Percival versus Lancelot. Welcome back to Rob's Arcade. I'm your host, Rob French. And this is Perfect. Grand Blue Fantasy. Strike with all your might. For New Game Friday, here on this mm. Sunday. For a special. Suit yourself, Lancelot. Episode. Let's begin. Of Rob's Arcade. Believe in victory. Battle one. Believe in Engage. victory. Engage. Uh. Uh. Stand down. Oh. Know your place. Then, huh? Too slow. Oh, but know your place. You're no match for me. So if you're uh Stand down. just joining me, Stand down. make sure slow. Um, you check out part one of this episode. I talk less about the actual game and more about anime itself. That's what happens when you play with fire. Player one win. But um, only because uh, this game here, Grand Blue Fantasy versus, uh, reminds me so much of some of the earlier um, video games I played as a kid. Um, I'm not done yet. Like on the Sega CD, especially. You own the burn. Um, and being a gamer in the early '90s and a huge fan of anime. I'm not done yet. Know your place. Slow. Stand down. Know your place. Huh? Oh, come on. Feel the burn. Feel the burn. Finish. Nice. Are you really lost? Yay. What's this? Finished already. So handsome. Get your act together, Lancelot. What is this That's four? No way for the Captain Look at that! Of the White Look at that! Four himself. zip, guys. All right, that's what I'm talking about. But yes, uh, so, uh, but yeah, this just kind of takes me back, man, to being a kid, a uh, teenager, and trying to get, um, like I said, my my anime fix, and um, not having, you know, the accessibility that you have today. Uh, really, was like the only place to get it. Sometimes was through the video games, and so this is really fun, really refreshing to see a really cool uh, fighting game uh, with some characters that I'm not that familiar with, um, but in a very smooth, very fluent fighting game. Very bright characters, very cool characters, very fun, sassy, and. Um, the cutscenes are phenomenal. Like I absolutely like I I would play this game just off based off of the the anime cutscenes alone. There were there were there are games in the past I have done this for. Um, Killer Seven was one. It promised um, like so many minutes of anime footage, and I just remember being like really excited about that. Like oh man, I want to play this game. And the game wasn't the the best. Uh, game, in my opinion, I didn't really get to see a whole lot of anime in that game. Uh, but this right here already promises um, to have some really cool cutscenes. And then, uh, you know, you're looking at, <clears throat> excuse me, uh, you're looking at different characters. So I mean, like based on like what character you decide to be, um, is Zeta. basically going to decide like what your um. You know, your cutscene is going to look like. Sure, Lana. Just kind of, just kind of cool. I think, anyway. Uh, but yeah, like I said, this game is based off of an RPG, um, which I thought was... Uh, Zeta versus 
Charlotta. Actually, Final Fantasy. Even I think their uh, logos are uh, very similar. Um, this was published by um, Psy Games, uh, TSS, Advent or TSS Ventures, Exceed Games, and Marvel. This is kind of reading some of this off of uh, Wikipedia. Built by System Works. You mean you don't use that thing to get a height advantage? Directed by well, Tetsuya Believe in victory. Hulk Uhara. One. Engage. Great. Now, sometimes also with uh games where I'm not really familiar with some of the characters. When it comes to, like, fighting games, it's not all that engaging. Uh, but this almost feels like these characters were, like, almost like, it's got, like, a Soul Calibur kind of feel to it. Even, uh, Mortal Kombat-esque, if I may. Player one. Win. And what I mean by that is that, Battle you know, uh, engage. look at games like Mortal Kombat, uh, Street Fighter, Tekken. Soul Calibur. These are characters, uh, they're just iconic. I mean, you don't need a, a background or a background, uh, um, a backstory uh, on who these characters are. Finish. A complete defeat. You know. Nothing worse than having someone nipping at your heels. I'm just gonna pick this shit oh, forever. Oh, sorry. I'm not calling you a tiny tot or anything. Huh. Uh, but like what I'm saying is like those characters are just iconic right away. You're like, oh man, you know, like you don't need any background. Then you have some games like, um, was it like Eternal Fighters or Warriors or something like that? And they try to like emulate and kind of do the same thing. And it's just like the characters don't quite have the same kind of grasp necessarily. Um, and then they'll do the same thing. Um, oh, no, I didn't want to do that. Believe in victory. Um, Battle one. Engage. They'll do the same thing even with... Um, that's what I mean. They'll do the same thing even like with uh, certain games. They'll try to bring the characters into like a fighting game. And it just doesn't really work all that well and this game like i feel like this uh if it wasn't um already an rpg um i feel like their versus title uh would just really work these are really cool character designs really cool styles colors weapons all of that i mean like there's just something um really really interesting about right, let's check out this we got an rpg mode I'll see what this is all about. I don't know if this is something... Uh-huh. Yeah, these characters just, just... They feel very natural. Feel, I mean, like, I would just... I would play this... Um... I'll take you on. Whoa. So what is this? Is this kind of like a tutorial, I guess, kind of a thing? How about this? Yeah. 
I can do this all day. You're not getting away. You're not getting away. I think I graduated. I start throwing fire. They're like, uh, you can dash or you can do this. I'll take you off. <laughs> I'm like, I'm throwing fire. Um, I'm not much on. Uh, actual RPGs. In fact, I think I've mentioned in other games. Uh, I think actually just in the uh, Need for Speed, which is also available right now, uh, there is that um, option of like uh, building up your car and picking your this and that and I'm almost just kind of like gosh I wish you guys would just do this for me excuse me a little more coffee there um you know just like character select if I'm gonna have a, a, a car like a race car you know yeah I, I guess I do want some choice over some of the specs uh but only to a degree, you know, there's something about like, you know, I just kind of want you guys to do it um, for me. Like just, you know, you guys decide where to put the power that I accumulate while I'm playing the game. That's best going to suit my uh, adventure, right? Lasaraga. What the heck is this dude about? Top heavy here. Lancelot. Same thing. I've been to like restaurants where like you kind of like you pick your meat, you pick your vegetables, and then they like kind of take you to a station. And um, oh, that's random. Okay, that's what I, I wonder. Like, why is that always taking me to the like, the same freaking level? Vasaraga versus Lancelot. So like like auto thinking like it was like an auto generate the level I don't know I don't know what I'm thinking again clearly I don't know like I can't even um, do random select on a, on a screen do it for me <laughs> just do it for me video game there we go Your presence alone is chilling Different. How many times have you escaped the jaws Some of different death? Different scenery here, guys. <laughs> Countless times. But it was like a, uh, an X-Men game. Ally. I remember playing. I think it was on the GameCube. Believe in victory. That was Battle an RPG. That's probably know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Like a huge target. But the Check. Down. This doesn't bode well. 
I'm not but you had like, uh, sure. you know, decide where like you put Player your one. your points Win. and your powers and all of that stuff. And I mean, I guess Battle two. some Engage. gamers, you know, <laughs> like the idea of like you know, building the character exactly the way you they would, you know, do some of the stuff in you know, real life. Uh, but I just, you know, I felt like it took up too much time in the game. It kind of pulled me out of the story. I'm sitting there, like, trying to figure out, like, all right, where does, where is the best way to spend my points? And, uh, no shame in this defeat. I felt got the edge as far as like, swordsmanship and agility. I'm just more durable. It sounds to look at this guy. He does not sound that sophisticated. That's a very scholar-like uh, voice uh, coming from that gentleman there. Uh, but yeah, I just felt like it took me out of the gameplay and everything. And I, and it's, I don't know. Um, I, I did enjoy playing some like the original Final Fantasy uh, games, but also feel like yeah, they just they take up so much time just in general. I mean, like there these games are like you know. 80 hours plus of like gameplay and adventure and depending on where you go and how much time you take and again you know where you put your attributes and character select how much you want to build up your attributes and it's all these things it's just um i guess for the more um like i said maybe in depth gamer those are features that are you know Uh, but yeah, I guess those are like, you know, some like of the, some attributes of games that, you know, those players design. Desirable. But yeah, so far I'm like I'm enjoying this game, and oh yeah, I guess before we run out of time, gosh, I'm getting just kind of like caught up in the anime and being all nostalgic and everything. Um, you know, I've been also like uh, reviewing these games when I first started doing uh, these new game Fridays or new game Sundays, as we have it here. Um, I didn't always like give like a rating or a review. Sometimes I would just play for like 15, 20 minutes. You're just kind of like show you a little bit of the partner, game huh? and like that would be the new game Friday. And that's not really um, giving any game justice. Sometimes just the Engage. opening story um, no takes 20, no 30 minutes. Do it, okay, your turn. So... Okay. I started doing like more parts. Okay, these new game Fridays. I'm giving you guys a chance to see more of the game. And then also, um, ah, doing a review or like a rating rather. Kind of like a, a keeper or a sleeper, if you will. Or a, not a sleeper. Sleeper is a game that's like awesome. Well, I guess this, this is kind of a sleeper. Because this is an awesome game that I didn't even know how this is. Oh, come on. Do something. Oh my gosh. This chick's. Sucks. Fairy? I'll have to watch out for that spear. What's she doing? No! No! Win. Fight! It's like Hulk. No! <laughs> Battle. Two. Um, but yeah, I guess this is kind of a sleeper game, but I guess it would be a keeper or a sleeper. But sweep it away. 
I'll deal with it. I don't really get this character here. I feel like he's got some sweet moves to figure out how to get the combo down right, but I don't think he's just like throwing that thing like that up in the air. Seems like a waste. Finish. Yeah, this is definitely a keeper for sure. Um, We're unstoppable together. And I, I get bright, this. Like, all right, so uh, my rating system's like eight bits. Um, rating like system, her. you know, like With eight work. is the best. It's kind of like a ten out of ten or five stars. Eight's the best bits you can get. Um, that was the best bits I could get back in the day when I first started started playing video games. So that's kind of like what I base my rating system on. Um, I give this an 8 out of 8 bits. Uh, it's great. I love the colors. I love the designs. I love the characters, the music, uh, the background, uh, like the, 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 the scenes. Um, these characters are fun. Uh, even the just the few that you get right off the jump here uh, I'm not really sure uh, how you unlock uh, more characters I don't know if there's like a pay feature or something you have to do a pass you have to buy um, let's see real quick does it tell you why you can't <clears throat> um, but it's got I mean like a huge cast of characters and just even the, 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 you know, the little over a handful that you get access to right off the jump, it's pretty impressive. Uh, but like, you know, it, the, I love the, like the painting style here that we have at the um, character select screens. The way. Change. I guess for right now. Solid skin you can choose. Uh, but then I like how it's you know the, the the art style then switches up for the the fighting sequences. You get more of a, like a cell, um, anime. Louis versus Fairy. Manga. The style here for the, uh, you know, the animation, like more traditional anime style for these little cutscenes here. Be willing to teach us popular colloquialisms. Give it a shot, everyone. Wait. So yeah, uh, I don't know, man. Let, let me know what you guys think. R four is going to tell me to start. Uh, do man, could give her a crash course. Turn up the bro factor to eleven. Going to start, you know, tell me to wrap this game up here a little bit. Uh, but let me know what you guys think. Uh, like I said, I was going to. This is it's actually October uh, the second uh, right now. Uh, Sunday. And I was gonna wait and maybe post this next week, um, but I don't think this game will be available next week. So I wanted to go ahead and just do a. Um, Check it out. Like a Sunday edition of New Game Friday. So if you have a PlayStation Plus 
membership, or you know somebody who does, and you're like, dude, this game is for free right now. Um, Next round, guys. We totally need to check this game out. Um, Player one. You know, I just wanted you guys to have a chance to take a look at this game. Um, Battle two. See if it's something Engage. you guys would be interested in. Um, hopefully, this video was something you guys are interested in. Go ahead, hit that um, like button for me for all support. Or give me a thumbs down if you didn't like it. I don't mind. If you love me, you can hate me. Just don't, just don't be in the middle. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you guys think of this game. Let me know what your favorite anime is. Make sure you share this. Make sure you subscribe. And remember, guys, this isn't goodbye. Simply to be continued. And until next time, don't spin that quarter anywhere else. Thank you so much, guys. Be good to yourself. Be good to each other. Later. No pain, no gain, baby. Who whips the whore?